With 2016 comes the dawn of a new age of interactive entertainment. From golfing around at the links with friends to exploring dark corridors alone, here are our 11 most anticipated VR games we just can't wait to play in 2016. Edge of Nowhere is shaping up to be an action-packed and immersive experience. It's one of a small handful of VR games that isn't played in the first person. Instead, everything plays out from a third-person perspective as you explore the depths of terrifying Antarctic mountains. And did I mention it's being developed exclusively for VR by the acclaimed developer of Sunset Overdrive, Ratchet and & Clank, and Resistance, Insomniac Games? That alone should be enough to earn your attention. 100 Foot Robot Golf is exactly what the title suggests. You'll control 100 foot tall robots as they play golf. What's not to like? It looks like one of the most hilariously entertaining games coming soon to VR. From the moment Eve Valkyrie debuted at E3 2015, our minds were overwhelmed. Flying through space, you can look around to survey your surroundings and track enemies while piloting the ship using the controller. It's looking to be one of the most visually stunning and polished VR games to date. The Climb from Crytek is all about the perils of rock climbing, which makes it equal parts terrifying and exciting. Hanging around hundreds of feet off the ground by nothing more than your fingertips is bound to deliver a touch of vertigo. Just don't look down. The Assembly's major appeal is in its thought out and intriguing world. Each of two characters possesses immensely different perspectives on the game's events. Playing from different points of view not only makes the questionable and often disturbing happenings all the more ambiguous, it also shifts your perception as well. Slower paced adventure games and interactive stories are excellent experiences to tackle for VR, and the assembly aims to set the bar high. Res Infinite is a much improved and visually striking reboot of the classic Sega game. Part music game and part shooter, it's bound to be one of the most psychedelic experiences on VR and feels tailor-made for the experience. Is there anything more terrifying than drifting endlessly in the deep expanses of outer space? We're not sure, but Adrift is going to provide us with the opportunity to find out. The thrilling tale of an astronaut trapped in space is at the forefront of this VR experience, and we can't wait to don our space gear and strap in for the ride. Affected is being billed as THE virtual reality horror experience. Naturally, the isolation and completely immersive quality of VR makes horror games a perfect, albeit terrifying, fit. If movies and games don't usually scare you, give VR horror a shot. Lucky's Tale is a colorful and vibrant platformer world. The sense of scale and verticality involved is a sight to behold and is bound to deliver a new perspective on the third-person platforming genre. As part mech shooter, part sports match, Riggs is one of the more innovative VR games we've seen. It's not only one of the fastest and most exhilarating games announced for VR thus far, but it's also one of the smoothest and least nauseating to play. And did we mention it has mechs? Because it has mechs! Old Space VR isn't so much a game as it is a social VR platform. Avatars are emotive, based on your real-world movements and input, which immediately creates a believable sense of interaction between people. You can play a game of real tabletop Dungeons & Dragons while in Old Space VR, and it feels like everyone is in the same room together. The platform is just getting started, and who knows where it could go next. 2016 will go down as the year true VR finally became real, and we can't wait. For all your VR game news and information, stick with us here at IGN.